We're back on the Gaiety stage. Another show is coming up, this with the Manx Operatic Society and Little Shop of Horrors. Anthony is uh, with us, who's returning to the Ops after a little break, isn't it? After a few a years. a long time. I think about 11 years since I was last with the Ops. Wow. Yeah. Because I know you've done DCU as well, all sorts. Done DCU as well, and I've had a couple of my own shows over yeah. here as well. So, yeah, it's nice to be back. OK, well, the shows are coming thick and fast at the minute, aren't they? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> How's the island coping with so many yeah. shows? But this one, um, I've seen it a few times. I mean, it's a great, great show for everyone, isn't it? It is. It's a great, fun show. I mean, that, that's the great thing about this. It is family orientated. It's a fun show. Um, yeah, just lots going for it. OK, we're going to show a little bit at the beginning, not, not give away anything too, too much. But, you know, sell it to us. What's, what's it about? Sell People it. don't know. It, it's, it's a great story. Basically, it's a love story involving a man eating plant. <laughs> so <laughs> <laughs> work into that what you will. Um, Audrey and Seymour. Seymour, they. Uh, works in the florist shop, falls in love with Audrey, who also works there. But he knows he's the eternal nerd. He's never going to get the girl. And then this magical plant appears, which offers him fame and fortune. But the snag is he has to keep feeding the plant, and the plant has a bit of a penchant for human blood. So he decides to go on a bit of a killing spree purely to get the girl. Right. Yeah, It sounds quite horrific. It's not this huge yeah. humour, and it's a very moving story. I mean, a lot of people they'll see the film, of course. Does it? Are they similar? It's very, very similar. The only thing that's different in the movie is the ending. The oh. ending's very different. Um, but in this one, it's a bit more poignant. Okay. Yeah. Now, the make or break is really the, the plant. I mean, I've seen versions with the big plants and ones with not so yeah. big plants. I mean, how big are you going? Big. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we've got a ginormous plant. We hired them from the guy who did it in the West End, uh, from the plant makers, and he also worked on the movie as one of the plant operators. Um, for Disney, and he has designed these plants, and we've got these. Okay. Is it suitable for everybody, family show? I think so, yeah, because I think kids, you know, it, the main thing is the humour, and when you see a, a plant having a dance to a rock and roll beat, it's <laughs> got to be good. Okay. It's got to be good. Kids are going to love it, yeah. Right. Now, we're here at dress rehearsal, so you're opening on Friday. We open Friday, so dress rehearsal starts sure. about 15 minutes, and yeah. And that's on for the full run, is it? Always? It's on till the following Saturday, so eight days, including the Sunday. We've got a Sunday matinee, which is especially family, it's especially done for the family audience. And because it's Father's Day, we thought we'd do a bit of a treat. Huh. So if Dad pays full price, but he can bring two kids and they're only a pound a ticket. Okay, okay, it works. I, I guess yeah, so, yeah, so they, it's sort of the dad is treating the kids. Yeah. That's how it works. Fine. OK, well, here, it's at the Gaiety. Uh, usual place to get the tickets. Absolutely. The Gaiety, you can get them on the door. You can get them at the Gaiety box office, at the Villa Marina. Yes, come and see the show. It's wonderful. You'll really enjoy it. You sold it. I've sold it. I've sold it. There we go. I should be on stage. We are. <laughs> <laughs>